Hey, this video is going to be on disabling collision between players. So we're going to first put a server script in server script service. And all we're going to need is physics service to do this. It's practically built into Roblox. So we're just going to say a game, uh, get service, physics service, and we're storing it under physics service variable. Now we're going to create a what's called a collision group for players. And the way we do that is we just say physics service, create collision group, and it's a string, so we say players. That's the first parameter. Now, to make it so that players can't collide with other players, we're going to say uh, physics service, uh, collision group, set collidable. And the first argument is going to be the name of the first collision group, and the second argument is going to be the name of the second collision group. Right now, they're both the same collision group. So we're actually saying that everything within this group can't collide with itself. So now we need to put the actual players in that collision group. So we're going to say game, players, player added, connect. Uh, and this just fires every time a player joins the game. Um, and then we're going to say player character added connect function. And then we'll put char here. Um, and we're going to wait uh, until the char, char character is fully loaded. So we're going to wait for the, the uh, humanoid here. And then after we've done that, we're just going to do a loop for every part within the character. So character part in pairs. Uh, we're looking through character, get children. Do, and then we're gonna say character part set, oh wait, actually, sorry. <laughs> we need to check the character part uh, is a base part because we can't set the collision group of a non-base part instance. Then, if it is a base part, then we're going to say character part set, sorry, <laughs> physics service set part collision group. And the first argument is going to be the character part. Second argument is going to be players because that's the name of the collision group. Uh, sorry, character part. We're also going to remove the uh, variable here and just have it like that. Okay. Now this this will disable collisions between your players, uh, and hopefully this tutorial helped.